really care if you try. Pistol right to your stomach, die. Sing, John, you gon' catch in your eye. Baby, I ain't not afraid to die. Hey, push me to the edge, running really fast. Wish you really dead. Push me to the edge, yeah, I hate my eggs. St. John, you a bitch. Push me to the edge. Hey, what's up, what's happening? It's Kid, we back in the stand. Case your buddy, he sleep with a cut up a turn, you know, little nigga wanna talk. We to talk about Lil Uzi for it, Lil Uzi for it, you me? Now, as the song goes, you know, we know his career has revolved around Britney, you know, the Love is Rage albums and all this stuff. A lot of those songs were about his relationships with Britney. You know what I'm saying? We seen them together, they were like some power ass couple. But then she faded into obscurity after he broke up with her, and now my nigga with a city girl JT, you know, doing this thing by the way. JT bad as a motherfucker. I'm pretty sure everybody know that hill. But before we really get into this, like and subscribe one more time if you was out there doing the little footsie shuffle, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, it was what it was. Now we had to talk about shit. Now we all know Uzi, even though he dresses flexible, you know. This motherfucker is a real nigga. This man made Rich the Kid run for the hills. I never seen Rich the Kid run that fast a day in my life. He always called himself the big boss. I never knew the boss would have to do the running for himself. I was I was I was perplexed by this situation. And now we have seen this happen again. Now basically what happened is uh, allegedly Uzi was trying to catch a fade with St. John and he put a gun to Britney Bird's stomach trying to shoot her and shit and he slapped it and he ran away and I'm just like Excuse me, man. Now we all know this nigga Lil Uzi is just like some fucking anime character come to life. This motherfucker wanted to be Vision from Marvel so bad that he implanted a rose color diamond into his forehead to live out some imaginary dream he had. Ridiculous. Re fucking ridiculous. Wait, I hope I hope he took that up. But I hope he took it. <laughs> it's one thing for Sauce Walker to put one on his cheek, but. Here, my ni my nigga. What the fuck in the hell? By the way, sorry for the background noise. Black people, you know what I'm saying? Hey, it's tennis season. Hey, motherfuckers in my career, they be losing the tennis. You me? But anyways, I subscribe. You just got my annoying motherfuckers in the background. I just love some bullshit. But anyway, we really here to talk about this. Now, I am just perplexed. This has happened. This motherfucker, this emo goth anime character, fucking uh, Black Light Yagami mixed with Marvel Avengers Vision himself, walking around here taking justice into his own hands. And I just have to be, I'm just astounded. Now, this is the one thing about the hip hop community I really don't understand. Listen, it's different if both of you's famous. Like, Drake, when Drake and Rihanna date, cool, but it's like, ASAP Brian, Rocky probably gonna wanna come out like that. That's perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Boy, at the same time, it also is like, where the fuck did this go? I was saying at the same time, it's basically, where the fuck did this go wrong in this situation? It make no fucking sense. Apparently, this happened. Let's read this shit to be like, I just like the fact, just Lil Uzi trying to fight like a six foot two nigga. Like what? This nigga is five one. Excuse me. I just gotta read this shit. I imagine this nigga was sashing like a bad bitch. I ain't gonna lie to you. Hey, but anyways, Lil Uzi Vert accused of flashing gun during fight with St. John and ex-girlfriend Britney Berg. Lil Uzi Vert has been spotted with his girlfriend, City Girl JT, for months now, but now he's facing some wild allegations of opening his ex-girlfriend and Grammy Award-winning rapper St. John. He won a Grammy? Okay. According to TMZ, both hip-hop stars who ironically both appear on LeBron James' upcoming Space Jam, a new legacy soundtrack album, got involved in a scuffle at Dialogue Cafe in West Hollywood that resulted in the Exo Tour Life rapper brandishing a gun somehow. Sources claim St. John and his and the and the former Miss Uzi for why couldn't you just say Uzi's ex, Brittany Bird, were at the restaurant working on a business project? And have been spotted together for months when Uzi pulled up in a Cadillac Escalade, confronting the table and eventually swinging and missing St. John altogether. As a result of the failed punch, the gun allegedly fell from Uzi's person, to which was said to have been recovered, only for the weapon to be pushed into Britney Bird's stomach. She was then allegedly struck in some fashion during the melee. Timzy reports the artist and museum curator will be filling a police report once she's out of the house how hard this nigga hair wait nigga uzi falcon punch bird and jt previously had a trending topic including online altercation the main following the couple's 
cover shoot for Arena Home Magazine. Ho would literally die to be in my shoes with the success I have. The Torculator rapper wrote on the wrote at the time, all N words and drip aside, I shit on you, your whole fake life, homeless ass helper. Neither Lil Uzi Vert nor St. John have been taken to social media to claim fact or cap on this report. You tell me Uzi be side shit and shoulder rubbing, you know what I'm saying? Doing the little eye shit, doing this nigga, and they try to swing on a nigga, dropped the gun for a lot, and then this nigga pushed it on his ex shorty, gave her the beats, and then fled? Oh, hell no. <laughs> This nigga Uzi was doing the footsie shuffle and got into an altercade. This is ridiculous. <laughs> hey, I need some more information on this shit, bro. There is no way I need more information on this motherfucker right here. Because this shit sounds too good to be true. I need some proof. I need some video. There's probably is a video circling around. It's a public place. It's a restaurant. I'm pretty sure they have cameras and shit, but... Bro, it was like this. I don't understand why rap niggas be going after women. It's different if y'all was famous and shit, like uh, Drake and uh, Rihanna and then ASAP Rocky. Like, y'all both famous, y'all doing whatever y'all date in your profession or whatever the fuck, right? But if it's like like just a regular chick and then you date a dude and then the next dude just pulls up and take it's like, nigga, why? You got all these groupies and all these other people trying to get your attention, but the girl, like, the hometown girl that this dude dated, like, you just own that now? It make no sense. You honestly don't. Bro, this, this is just something so comical. I need a video. I'm not. <laughs> Bro, Uzi was feeling him, but that nigga was vulgar. <laughs> that nigga was on. <laughs> hey, we all know Uzi a nigga that like to scrap. Has been said a lot. I'm from Philly. I like to scrap with Uzi. For this nigga like 6'5". Uzi, and both of y'all flexible. Seen John got some bullshit in his head. Uzi, you always flexible. Got some pink diamonds on your forehead looking like the Pink Panther reject. Like, come on, nah. What type of bullshit is that? Man, listen. I don't know if this is from, like, JT. Like, yo, your girlfriend be doing too much. Go handle her. Go talk to her. And this is what led to him going to talk to her or him trying to scare her or whatever the fuck but this is ridiculous and the fact she's gonna put yo your ass might end up in jail with you. if she's gonna really press a police report on your ass your ass really going to jail how hard did you hit her the f she's in the hospital how hard did you hit her the fuck oz this ain't looking good for your ass i'm gonna send your ass to court like bro this is some chris brown shit this is some Christopher brown shit this is some tory lane shit but see, and then this is the thing we have to ask hip hop fans: Are you gonna forgive Uzi for this shit? Cause Tory, y'all try to cancel him. Chris Brown for a while, you trying to cancel him, but he is talented. Tory coming back right now, cause he's talented as a motherfucker. So Uzi, we gonna see what's gonna happen with Uzi. We are gonna see JT going on him down at this point. We don't know what the fuck gonna happen with this situation. This is just ridiculous. I could just imagine this nigga just shoulder rolling into a local punch, fam. Like, what type of bullshit is this? This is ridiculous. Shit, I'm surprised Uzi didn't make St. John run for the hill that rich the kid. So, <laughs> hey man, enough enough of the jokes. We're gonna see what's gonna happen. This is a serious thing. I hope she does recover. We're gonna see what happens with this situation though as more information comes out. TMZ bro, y'all Y'all some hoes for this. If this shit ain't true, I know they got the video too. This is hey man. It what it is, man. But anyways, I'm off of this thing. I subscribe. Hope your boy, I hope your boy goes being KA. I'm off of this thing real quick. You know what it is. Slime Zoom Peace, y'all. Oh, this guy. I.